I'm here with Lisa from eLumina, which is an interesting company, Australian company that sells really specialist DC fast charging products like this for remote places and regional areas. Tell us more about this, Lisa. Yeah, so it's actually regional remote, but anywhere that actually has no grid or unstable grid or low grid supply. That's what we specialize in. This video was made thanks to generous support from the organizations and individuals on screen. So you can have as little as, you know, 10 kilowatts of input power to get up to 200 kilowatts output power or a more beefed up version, 20 kilowatts of power available can give you 400 kilowatts of yeah, output power. Yeah, let's have a look at that. That's yep. literally arrived in the country like just a day ago. That's the new DS400 model. Yep. And what's the capacity? So it's a 350 kilowatt battery um, and it's a, a cattle battery, cattle battery cells, so very stable. It can actually run completely off grid. So you can have 400 kilowatts of output charge achieved with ground mount solar or biodiesel generators, or you could have as low as 20 kilowatts of grid power to achieve 400 kilowatts of output charge. Right. So that yeah. means it's not like you're getting low performance just because you're out in the middle of nowhere going out on an outback adventure or you maybe a, you're a salesperson or whatever you're doing out there in your EV across the wide brown land. You could have a car like the Ionic 6 or another 800 volt car and still get top charging performance. Correct. Vita 7X, for example. Correct. Even buses and trucks. Like, yeah, and wow. that's really helping the transition for um, trucks that might want 350 kilowatts of charge, but the truck depot only has maybe 70 kilowatts available. You can feed 70 kilowatts into the battery buffer you know, and then achieve 400 kilowatts out. So yeah. it's definitely a game changer. And it means you can have fast charging anywhere in the country. And there's no excuses yeah. anymore. Where's some examples? Like I've seen yeah. that particular model at NRMA Mittagong. Yeah. Uh, Malvern in Queensland. Malvern in Queensland, which yeah. is eight hours west of Brisbane. That's pretty um, remote. Yeah, Port Perry, um, O'Connor over in Perth. Yep. Um, many other sites. And also there's um, like Essential Energy have also installed this for their own private truck use. Um, so they're not public charging, but they've put it um, at five of their sites now for their own EV trucks. Okay. Essential yeah. Energy is the regional grid provider for New South Wales. Yes, yeah. that's correct. Yeah. Okay. Um, and we also have um, now electrified the Great Northern Highway. So from Perth to the Pilbara. Right. Um, starting from Port Perry and then going up to um, Auskey Roadhouse. Okay. What network is that on if people want to use it? Um, so at the moment, it's only on our own because it's going through testing. Right. Um, and, uh, but it will be on Chargefox as of okay. February. Right. Yeah. Okay. So February 2026. It'll be a lot easier to drive your EV 100%. up north to the Pilbara. A hundred percent. Beautiful country. I've yes. been there when in my 20s, backpacking, gorgeous <laughs> landscapes. And uh, you'll be able to have a guaranteed charge there. Actually, that's a really good point. This has got such a big battery. It's not like the first one or two cars that come in a row will get a good charge. Probably four or five or six can get almost a full charge. And if they're partial charges, potentially maybe even around 10 yeah, different vehicles in a row. That's correct. And if you do have some grid power going in, um, you will still, even if the battery is fully depleted, you'll still get the grid power coming into the car. So if you had 40 kilowatts going in, you're still going to get 40 kilowatts coming out. So um, even if the battery is depleted, it still works. Um, and, and, and that's important to make sure that people aren't stranded. Yeah. Mm. This is a great solution, I think, for Outback EV charging. Bring yeah. on more of them. Yeah. Thanks, Lisa. No worries. Thanks, Harry. Cheers. Thank you. Bye. Thanks for liking, subscribing, and sharing my videos. It really helps me make more videos like this for you. And have a look at the suggested videos up above. I'm pretty sure you'll like those as well. Thanks, and see you later.